We are live, Mr. Hacks in the building. Let me refresh. Make sure you can see me. Make sure you can hear me. Make sure there's no echo and that everything is set before we start this live show. We got so many things to talk about, so many things to get into. And let me get this out of the way and see who is here first. And El Gronk, can't wait for those UNCs, Jose and Kadian, uh, Spicy Memer, which I had to uh, block them, Patrick, uh, Aurora Gaming, Stevie D, uh, Felicia, what's up, and still kicking at sports, and let's see, you keep going down, Lex on eBay, aka Flex on eBay, True Win, Midwest Thrift, Curtis, Mr. More Mo, Jimmy, and we keep going down. Flips Anonymous, Extra oh, extra Grands, Swoopman, Ross Shallington in the house, Red Drums, and Mendes Fines, Hustle and Silence, Nick and Nicholas, and Drake, still kicking at sports. Uh, my boy, Texas Pete, and Jose, Tristan, Gio, Madrill, Faith Lopez, Christian Lopez. Keep going down. Vince, OG Kicks, Willie Will. Brian and Lucky on Three Legs, Manny Fresh, uh, Ross Highsmith, which I gotta say thank you for the hookup on the Vince Carters. I was looking for these shocks and Ross Highsmith. Thank you for that. And got them, was it earlier this week that we were <laughs> trying to figure out what happened? But yes, we got them and they're awesome. I haven't worn them yet, but I will. Smooth selling. And Gino and Zach, Hustle and Muscle, K Brady, and keep going down. Lakeisha District Deals. And uh, let's see, Fardin, little squad. I can't even say that one. Uh, Happy Camper, Rocky, and Juan. More people coming in. Now, uh, Miles, what's up? And Doug the Pug. Before we start, first thing, thoughts and prayers for everybody in Tennessee. Um, everybody that was affected by tornadoes and I feel like it got kind of, I mean, it's still, I don't know. I feel like it got kind of swept under the rug a bit because of coronavirus. Like that's the only thing news is just I don't know, throwing in our face coronavirus over, over, but like people got affected by this and the tornadoes, everything that's going on right now. It's like, come on. Uh, but coronavirus and yes, people, what is it? Hand sanitizers. Everybody's out. Everybody's probably, they're flipping masks. They're flipping sanitizers. Toilet paper will be next. Um, but yeah, that's what I'm going to talk about for that one. And what else are we going to say uh, before we start the show? Uh, Democratic primary. We survive here in Tennessee. Smooth selling. Um, that's, awesome. that's awesome and great to hear because I know um, so many people in Tennessee out there hustling and flipping and watch, uh, you know, the live show. So can't say the word demonetized. So appreciate that. Lenny, what's up? All right. Let me get this out of the way. Now, before we start, oh, man, there's too many uh, things going on here. Share screen, share screen, and all right, I'm going to do this a couple of times uh, throughout the live show. Here's the first time we're going to talk about it. Out Hustled 2020. People have been asking. Um, Mr. or the middle M199. Appreciate that. Two bucks on the super chat. Here we go. I need to know rough numbers. And in order to do that, all you got to do is go to hustlerhacks.com slash out hustled. And I will put it here in the chat. Hustlerhacks.com slash out hustled name and email. Instagram handle is optional. That's only uh, if once we get everything going, I can tag you if it's easier that way. But we do need uh, email for sure. Now, which city are you interested in? L.A., Denver, Las Vegas, Dallas, Miami, Philadelphia. You can choose more than one. Um, I can tell you right now, more than likely, we're going to do three to four out of these cities. So it's extremely important that you fill this out. And we get the roughly, you know, how many are interested in which city. Because if one city is kind of slacking it and one city is just overbearing, which I have a feeling that L.A. will be, then uh, we might have to do different types of workshops, maybe multiple days. 
Might have to do something uh, to make sure we get that done. So whichever one is closer to you, and if you can make it out to that trip, if people are already submitting, because I'm getting alerts on the phone, so I appreciate that. And I'll do uh, this little out hustle thing, middle of the show. And again, before we leave, to remind you to fill this out and we can get a rough number. And I can tell you right now, the workshop is going to be awesome. We have great ideas for it too, because the first off, the giveaways are going to be insane for these. Second, we're also going to do the VIP thing again uh, to where we can hang out and do kind of like a limited group. And the third thing is we are also going to do one-on-ones, which will be included in what's already going on. So not like it's going to be some huge overpriced thing already included one-on-one. Bring your questions, laptops, uh, whatever you want to do. Whatever you want to do in that time with me and you, one-on-one. You want to hang out? You want to bring pizza? You want to eat, eat pizza and hang out? We can definitely do that. You want to record a podcast thing? We can do that too. You want to ask questions to help the business? We'll damn sure do that. So fill that out and I'll remind you guys midway throughout the show. So let me get this out of the way. Hit that like button, Dapper Fanatic. I appreciate that. Stop screen. Let me go back to our, actually, when you get to our slideshow. So let me get this out of the way. Again, application window and we are set okay our opening segment which is this real Bruh. where we talked about this last week and back during travis scott's is this real or not real now people were saying this is 100 real this uh, skate shop is still open and they did this now somebody else was saying this is not real and this did not happen this skate shop has been closed and i don't know so people uh, in New Jersey, what do you say? Duh, it's real. Doug the Pug. Um, <laughs> Philly Equals Hustler Summit meeting. I have a feeling that uh, Philly is going to be insane as far as everybody that's been contacting me and telling me they're going to go to the Philly workshop. Um, I think Philly is the one you definitely want to go to. Let's see. I think it's real. I would do it. We talked about this on the live show last week saying that this is almost like a no-brainer, almost like an obvious thing that they would be doing backdooring these. And you know how much they're worth. Why wouldn't you do this? And sure enough, we got this photo uh, about what? Eight, no, about 20 pairs right here. Uh, let's see. Hitters say Photoshop. It's real. Flight Club. He goes to my basement. Real. That's at least 20K. I'm in there. Philly from Geo. Flight Club got the plug. Uh, so I think this is just like obvious. I mean, backdooring to friends, family, but here, just go straight to the resale and get your money. Uh, big skate shops actually sold them, and hopefully they made it easy, and you don't have to throw away the box or wear them out or rap Travis Scott songs. Hopefully they made it uh, decent for you. But let's talk about Jordan 1 High Pine Green. Now, was it as projected? We talked about the smaller sizes, but even then... Uh, not bad. I want to pick it up for 209, 208. Uh, my size were at 200. Last sale, 189. Highest bid, 186. Hey, not bad, especially at retail being at 170. So, Zapata said sleeper, sneaky feet. What's up? Let's see, sat from Nick. Um, let's see, they would sell them on go, not take them to flight club. Talking about the Travis Scott's. So, the Jordan one, though, I think if you really, really wanted them, they were not hard. I know. So many people got them sneakers app that people never pick up anything, picked up multiple pairs. Um, we know Finish Line got them as well. Let me see. Dookie Green, Hustle Muscle. Uh, let's see. <laughs> They're nice. Finally catching the live show through Soul. Appreciate that. Uh, what's up, Derek Lee? Might be a good hold. And I agree. Might be a good hold for down the road. Um, if you're picking them up, people are letting them go for cheap. 186, 189. I mean, it's not bad at all. And let me see, 200, 204, some of the smaller ones, 208. So people that are not patient, rushing through them, trying to get them out, might be your best bet to invest in them, hold on for the long term. So solid for the personal, hopefully a couple of pairs sneak into the Nike outlets. Uh, mine's just arrived from Enrique. They might go to the outlets, people returning them because they thought they were going to resell more. 
but I hopefully that will happen to the UNCs, um, especially in my size, 11, 11 and a half kind of happens. People get a little overhyped, think they're going to uh, resell, and then uh, they end up not doing that. So <laughs> we'll see what happens, but hopefully they return them and we can scoop them up at the outlets. Making $10 profits. There you go, Doug the Pug. All right, let's get into eBay solds. Now, our first one, I'm a little behind on this. Um, I should probably do more of these per week. I actually do like three or four. I should probably do more, like five or six of them, because these are a little bit older. Uh, February 23rd. Anyways, Vermax Utility, and man, these boys paid up, especially with tax, came out to 215.49. And we got these for 65 bucks, came out to 70 with uh, tax and eBay zero, PayPal 2205. Why are your PayPal fees so high? Um, shipping 850, they were a size eight, so didn't weigh as much. And our profit uh, over $114. And our, we got them at Ross February 12th and then sold on the 23rd and big ROI. Let's see, that's a solid sale. Uh, triple Black Romaleos, good, says four from Eric. Let's see, Keg Party at Stevie D's house for Out Hustled Philly, man. This guy's getting set. I can tell you too, um, let's see, Glenn's PayPal fees to eBay, hold my beer. <laughs> I can tell you too, uh, Hustleby, he's a little lightweight when it comes to the drinking. Um, we've seen him, we've seen him sick a couple of times and uh, I don't know. Hopefully you guys don't push it on them because it could get a little nasty. <laughs> That's good money. Texas Pete. I'm down. Stevie D. Keg Party Relentless Resale, which we hope to see in Philly. Uh, let's see. Count me in. Still kicking it sports. What's up? Drum the Hustler. And let's see. Do you sell anything other than shoes from Ross? I do have jerseys, other, um, you know, sports stuff in there, but mostly jerseys and shoes is what it comes down to. Uh, let's see. Can't wait. Hopefully meet you one day in Houston. Hopefully Houston, Dallas area. We're trying to figure that out. Hopefully we can. And you're right. What? You're right. You have to put, but the per, be personal business out there like that. <laughs> um, B, uh, well, who, who saw B during that? Well, a team saw B during that time, not drinking well. Um, who else saw him? Uh, Chris, uh, what's his name? Daily refinement. He saw B on some bad days, but maybe he's toughened up. Um, he That's that's kind of like an inside joke thing between me and B because I'm always sick. He always makes fun of me on that. And then when it comes to the drinking, we always make fun of the B. <laughs> All right, next one. A vapor, what? Air Zoom Vapor Kyrie 5 Tennis. And these we've had for a little bit, December 9th. Got them at Burlington, of course, but I do think Ross has been getting them lately. $44.99 with tax, came up to $48.70. Sold for 129 with tax came out to 138.76. I did promote them a bit, and that kind of hurt us. Nine dollars and ten cents. We usually like seeing the zeros on here. That didn't happen. Shipping ten bucks, but still good profit. More than what we actually paid. Fifty-seven dollars sixty-five cents. Burlington purchased December 9th, and ROI uh, 118. Okay, uh, <laughs> Zach. Oh man, yeah, that was a that was a good one during that time. Uh, are there any other girl uh, sneaker girls in here from Red Drum? Asking, there we go, laugh out loud. Uh, we did get a tag. We got a selfie girl in store, Ross. So you'll see that. Uh, let's see, no what? No free beer for Will. If it's on a Sunday because he's late for sourcing Monday. Daily refinement got to be a lightweight. Also from Stevie D. And oh yeah, Faith Lopez in the house. So there you go. Last one. Oh, no. We got another one. Oh, yeah. This is the last one. Uh, Air Max 95 OG. I think people are still finding these now. At Ross. Habanero colorway. Habanero red. $64.94. Sold for $140. It took the best offer. So eBay, my uh, promotion, $4.20. And PayPal, $6.46. Shipping, $11.79. And our profit, $52.55. Making $10 profit. Uh, I'm late to the party. Remind everybody about privacy affecting tags and uh, girl sneakerheads here. Where else are we? Ross Shellington will be having a beer and a lunch break only. Doug the Pug 420. <laughs> Magic number. How did that happen? And let's see. What up? Super 6 4. 
Okay. And next one, I thought PayPal pays for two, what? 2.9. Yes, including the tax. Um, let's see. Why'd you pay 2205 in PayPal fees? Because of the tax. Balling. All right, let's get into Air Jordan uh, Infrared 23 on these. How do you feel about this colorway debuted last month by Jordan brand athletes Luca, who apparently is a Dolphins fan. And I just saw a photo of him rocking a Dolphins hoodie. New respect uh, for Doncic. So I love that. Uh, Jason Tatum. And so they both rocked these during the All-Star Weekend in Chicago. So how do you feel about this one? I, I think it's a clean shoe. Smash, hustle and silence. Uh, colorway is cool. Sup from Thomas Dookie. Uh, <laughs> let's see, yuck, cheddar bob. Colorway is sick. We going up. Let's see, uh, Luca, your favorite player now because he's a Dolphins fan. Hey, if he wants to struggle with the rest of us, that's that's on him. Uh, what the hell is this? Infrared 23 or fire crickets, hard pass. Uh, those are kind of sick. Colorway is nice. Pass and hard pass and pass for sure. That's weak. Next one. Supreme Nike Air Force One. <laughs> and are they really $96? All I did was add the Supreme logo right here on the side and the insole and call the day. And Supremes and latest Nike collab, simplistic take, really simplistic take on iconic Air Force One. Black and white versions will be released and stamped with a recognizable red box logo on the heel. Let's see, fire behind the back pass. Uh, fire, let's see, I'm, I'm here. Caught for resale, fire, quick flip, fire. This collab is weak, I agree trash but money i also agree uh let's see stop saying these are fire they are regular <laughs> these i mean would you rock these and you might as well just buy cheap ass air force ones uh it, all all they did is add this on here it's i thought supreme stuff was just kind of like it's slowly but surely fading a bit but i mean you know you're gonna get money for these we know what's up with these but uh yeah this whole reselling thing has just become, you know, clout chasing and who finds the best stuff. And let's see what else they say. Stay that a pair of you restock with uh, their Hanes t-shirts or boxer briefs. <laughs> Half-ass ones from Miles. $2. Uh, middle and appreciate it. Cop them before they restock. Value going to go down. So 2 bucks. Thanks for that. And giving you some insight. All right. Jordan 2 Multicolor. Wow, look at that. <laughs> 190 is the price on this one. $2.69 as usual as usual from Stevie D. And Joel made 70k for 75k this week from selling hand sanitizer. Stevie D weekly $2.69. Let's go back. Jordan 2 Multicolor 190 comes out on Thursday, March 5th. And I do believe this is is this women's only. Uh, it doesn't say in here. I thought it was women's only. Seemingly out of nowhere, Jordan Brand is releasing a mismatched colorway of the Jordan 2. Multicolored pair mixes various bright shades and materials. Uh, yeah, cool. Uh, too busy, ugly, uh, big pass, my eyes. Yes, it is women. So all the ladies that are watching the live show, would you rock these? Smash or pass. Bowling shoe. <laughs> Uh, let's see, these are terrible, ugly leftover materials. I read a women's exclusive as well, so garbage. Uh, let's see, for a crazy look, but not for resale, I don't think. Faith says pass. Trash from Texas Pete. Let's see, garbage sauce. Uh, Bob Ross would rock those. Clown shoes. Hard pass. More clown shoes. And too much hate. Cop this one. Smash this one. 190. We're not done. LeBron 7 Fairfax. Now, some LeBron 7s have been showing up as returns. My local Nike outlets. People not, uh, not happy with them. I saw the white and gold one. I saw the blue one. Now we're getting this one. Uh, very, uh, this Fairfax High School. But also has a little, like, Miami Heat look. Look and feel to them, but Friday, March 6th, 10 a.m., 
price at two hundred dollars. I, I think it's a clean shoe. See, LeBron Seven, aka Backwall Special, Smash Times Ten. Uh, those are outlet bound, outlet stock. LeBron, uh, LeBron Seven, nice. I like it. Backwall Special, nice. Cop, all you pass the flop. It's okay. Uh, two hundred is too much. And uh, let's see, the swoosh is Cavaliers. Yeah, kind of like a Cavaliers on the swoosh. 100 from Jose is putting in bids, only to ball in. And let's see, smooth selling, $2. District deal, secret hideout, at out hustled. So you can, <laughs> uh, district deals. Well, the, the thing is, district deals goes to a different city. We got to figure out, like, you know, where does he source? What does he do? But you're not going to find him you know, in his right element. So it might be a little different, but $2 smooth selling. Appreciate that. Swish OK and LeBron 7 flea market. Ooh. All right, we're not done. This is our last one. Air Jordan 3 UNC. <laughs> 190 comes out on Saturday, March 7th at 10 a.m. And how do you feel about this one? Jordan 3 Retro, an obvious nod to Jordan's alma mater, UNC Tar Heels, which aren't having a very good season this season, but that doesn't matter. Uh, specifically, it's inspired by the PE, which we saw those, which is pretty awesome. And this one doesn't have all the details like the PE does, but we are getting a general release. So sports, uh, white tumbled leather upper elephant print wrapping around the toe and the heel. And you guys already know, about Jordan 3, so. Cop this one, smash this one. These are a beauty, uh, these are clean. So who's rocking these though? Who's buying them to actually rock them instead of reselling? And let's say reselling isn't that great, then I think that's good because the people that do want them, I think if, like I said, someone returns them to the outlets, anything like that, I'm all for it, hopefully in my size. Perfect personal pickup from Vince, $10. Hustle in silence. Balling. Ten bucks. Balling. And funding Hustler Snacks for the next thrift video. Thank you for that. We uh, Even for the next out hustle, we had to get some Hustler Snacks and do some sort of video for that. We haven't even seen uh, Ross Burlington some good snacks lately. So I appreciate that. Ten dollars. Let's see. Hi, did you do a giveaway? Not yet. For the collection, for sure, fire. I'm rocking those for sure. One to stock, one to rock. Let's see, just something to get dirty at Ross. <laughs> From Dom, Auto Cop. Let me see. It won't be resale, uh, which could happen. We know from the, uh, you know, just general releases. You never know. It just depends how many of them are really out there. And, of course, the hype. But um, I do think this one, I don't know. I'm kind of curious what's going to happen to these. Uh, rock them. Rock, love the hustle beat sound bites. And let's see, we go back. Uh, Ross got organic food gems. And <laughs> youth sizes will make it to Ross, probably. And I'm very sensitive. So they were done for all the drops. Oh, last one. I forgot to say, uh, I gave you guys a choice on the March Hustler Hog on the Kobe's. And I do think that the Jordan 6 DMPs are coming out this month or next month. But I do want to add that one in there as an option. So when it gets to the point where there's Fire Red 5s, Flint 13s, and also the DMP 6, then you can choose one. Uh, choose one of the three. So they will be a little bit better and a little variety. And you can uh, choose your size on that one. So that one will that be good. All right, let's go to... Oh, store updates. So um, I will not be at this Ross in Brooklyn. This is apparently some DJ guy. But in Ohio, we have that Ross that we talked about that was opening. And it is opening soon. That will be on Saturday. And look out for that. Any hustlers in Ohio? Looks like toilet water. Uh, let's see. Thank you, Lakeisha. Love watching you, uh, watching you and best for uh, Mr. Hacks. Love your videos. Appreciate that. They pushed the MP pack. Uh, I did see that, and then I don't know when they're uh, when they're coming out. So I gotta double check on that one. Crying from Texas, Pete. Uh, Rocky says it's my hood. Um, <laughs> let me see where are we. Rosses in Pennsylvania are good. Cincinnati from Brandon. 
And all right, I'm from Brooklyn. Let's get a cotton holly. All right, so Brooklyn, that one. And where's my New York peeps at? So they did some sort of article here on uh, Burlington opens early, a peak inside. So it's back in Kill New York. Did I say that right? Pooh Kips <laughs> Oh man, this is bad. Uh, do we know where this is? Let's put it that way. In the chat, do we know? And did we go here? Is it open? What's the story with this store? Let's see. Vince says Ross in Seattle sucks. Uh, Mr. Mormo says uh, New York here. Uh, we'll see. <laughs> Who else responds on this one? Every time a Ross opens, an RBX gets an owner from Dom. I do agree. Uh, Poo Kipsy. There we go. New station trying to flip all the vapor maxes from Josh Ross in Utah. Not that bad. Orange County, New York, Texas stand up. Uh, Cleveland from Rocky. Ismail, what's up? And Liverpool's, what's up? And have you ever seen Air Force 2 Max promos? Found a size 11 today. Pass for 60. Uh, I don't think I have seen them. Depends where. New Burlington in North Philly from Geo. So giving us the heads up. So check out for that one. And we need Ross in New York, which I do agree. And yes, and Texas stand up. All right. And we're done with that. I think we're getting into our power rankings already. 25 minutes in, 725. So we're almost there to the halfway point, which means I can remind you to, damn it, let me get this out of the way. Hold on. Uh, no, wrong button. Wrong button. And share your screen. Try again. Try again. And here we are. More people have just joined the live show. Here's my little reminder. I'll remind you again towards the end, towards the giveaway. Go to hustlerhacks.com slash out hustled because I want to meet you. And all I got to do, name, first name, last name, email. This is important. Instagram handle is optional. But if you give it to me, then I can tag you when we get all full details. What city are you interested in? LA, Denver, Vegas. Dallas, Miami, or Philly, and Stevie D, District Deals. Where's eBay, Joey? Um, Relentless Resale. Who's going to show up? Uh, Mr. Sports LA, I know I'm going to see you in LA. Click that button right there. We want to get some rough numbers, see who's interested, and if we have to put in more time and effort into one city because the numbers are higher, then we will do that, but I need to know the numbers. Okay, let me get this out of the way. And that is hustlerhacks.com slash out hustled. All right, we're done here. Let's go back to our slideshow. We got a brief commercial, commercial break. And here we go. And get this out of the way. Okay, we're set. Power rankings last week. DD's discounts one and a half. TJ Maxx with two. Burlington two and a half. Marshall's at four. And Rouse at five, bringing the heat. Here we go. DD's and TJ Maxx. TJ Maxx, uh, two stars. And DD's at one and a half. They're kind of staying um, as usual. Stealthy Finds, deal account 888. And Stealthy Finds again. We got PG's. We got the Reacts. And Mamba Focus, $35. I know some people have been making their trips to DD's discounts, hoping to pick up um, a little Mamba Focus, $35. I do believe Ross is getting them as well. And for that same price, we know and love. $35, so look out for that. Let's see. Let me go back up. Philly, LA, at Orlando. Um, one and a half stars, new record for DDs. I think they were one and a half last week, but they're they're consistent. I'll be in Philly in two weeks. Willie will. Uh, Atlanta will be cool. And we did do one in Atlanta. Um, I know Ross Shallington did ask, are we going to do another one? We'll keep you posted, but it looks like we're leaning towards Miami. All right, now TJ Maxx only two finds and Bofo merchandise with two Air Max 97s and of course in women's section. So we got the gray and white and we got this multicolor uh, pinkish peach looking thing. So two of them here and $60. Burlington time, three stars and they are uh, moving up a little bit. So Burlington kind of uh, catching fire. And so let's see. 
Michelle Dama, Miami Good, Rosh Allington. All right, flip the script and Fiercy, both $6 for $225 retail uh, Clemson jackets or pullovers, half a zip, quarter zip, whatever those are. $225 and only five bucks? Man, like, uh, I know. I know they lost, but six dollars. Okay, and then uh, next one we got uh, demand, Mister Information, forty dollars on some Grant Hill ninety six and smash or pass on the Grant Hills. Uh, my boy Jake, no to flip it. Also did see these out there in the wild, and he was talking about them. Yeah, he did get a little sad. He was a little sensitive. And I'm very sensitive. Because people weren't picking up old school Grant Hills. and But you let me know. Smash your pass. Would you pick them up for the collection? Would you rock them? Or to resell? Uh, not really there right now. Maybe down the road they'll go back up. Right now there's still like some sizes I saw. 70 bucks, 75 Not really a whole lot going on. But down the road, could happen. Or maybe you want to rock them. Uh, for the collection, and I haven't rocked mine in a long time because they are big and bulky. But maybe I will. Maybe I'll throw in a Grand Hill jersey, rock them a bit. Um, let's see. Yo, is Noah to flip it in this? He is. And I got stuck. <laughs> the sound bite got stuck. I'm an idiot. Oh, crap. There he goes. <laughs> uh, let's see. I wasn't outside and Grand Hills came out. Um, let me go back. Uh, I'm seeing them everywhere from Joe. Um, Clemson is sad they lost. I know five dollars to six dollars actually. Are people, not, are people picking up Grant Hills? I don't think they are. Um, I did see more of them out there. Let's see. I passed on 30 pairs of those and Jamal Mashburn's. <laughs> Jamal Mashburn, haven't heard of that name in a while. Uh, let's see. And uh, found some black Grant Hill threes. So, all right, next one. Sneaker finds 12, Willie Will, Suspicious Thrifter, and Willie Will again, all with Air Max Plus and some Tiger Woods back there. We're going to talk about Tiger Woods very soon. We also got Air Max One and the Sunset, which I believe are kids, and people are finding these in the kids. Tailwinds in here, and of course the uh, Air Max Plus, but there's uh, quite a bit to see in the box, and of course in Willie Will's cart. And here we go with the sunset. Now, different colorways. We got the purple one, purple gradient looking thing. We got the sunset colorway, both, I believe, for kids. Danny's finds, time to resell, Tan's finds, and NJ sneaker finds. So, what, four, five, six pairs here, a couple of them here. Smash or pass, are you picking these up from Burlington? I know some people are leaving them behind because they are a kid shoe. I don't know. Totally up to you. Cop this one, smash this one. Uh, let's see, Dan, six and a half, rather rock so no hit skis, smash, pass from Miles, uh, passed on a size four, sunset today, thread kicks, pass, I would smash those shoes, pass too small, sell it as women's, happy camper, very good advice, uh, over 100 or more, found a men's, nine and a half, sneaky feet, I would mix and match those, um, let me see, Smash uh, to sell on Goat, and Will is killing it, and let's see, Smash and Pass. All right, next one, Jim Minaj, Stone Builder, and Slick Nick Sneakers, and Sneaky Flips, all with the Jordan Legacy. So size 4, we have size 6, 5, and 4, $55, compare at 120 come with the extra laces. Now we're getting into some Tiger Woods leading on to the next slides as well. So fonts for fun hustle, thrifting together, who just went ham on this. Uh, sneaker finds 12, showing no mercy, uh, extra 15, also some great stuff in there. But then we're not done. We also got Price Assassins and Willy Will, um, also showing no mercy, space balls, extra grands. These are not Tiger Woods. We'll, we'll talk about this right now, but let's go back to the Tiger Woods. Uh, these, so what, one, two, a couple of pairs here, like six pairs. We got about like 10 pairs here, cartfuls, and more of them. So here's the question, smash or pass on the Tiger Woods. Does this scare you that people have cartful? 
would you still pick them up? How much are they, by the way? Because I can't see any prices on these. I'm guessing $24.99, maybe $19.99 in between that. Let's see what they say. Yes, I would. They're flooded. Uh, <laughs> Smash. Um, I would wear the pair of khakis. Uh, let's see. Smash. And size 12 hit me up. $24.99. Yeah, $25 all day. I don't care how many cartfuls. $25. This is auto cop. So, especially the black ones. You know, this is easy money right here. Uh, this is just money in a cart. Smash and hold. Audi. <laughs> Um, let's see, I picked them up, 45, let's see, Smash, and uh, for $24.99, got them today, and Smash for 25 yeah, for sure. Cop this one, Smash this one. I keep going. Hustle Nomics and Just Fire Finds, Elliot Thrifter Hunter, and Fast Eddie for Vapor, uh, what is this, Vapor Tech Challenge, 95s, I also got some Tiger Woods and other stuff in here. Just fire finds with a bunch of cleats, baseball cleats in here. And prices is $7.99 to $16. LA Thrifter Hunter bringing the heat with the cleats. Let me see. Uh, <laughs> see, do the giveaway. It's late. You want to survive in Miami? People out here are fierce. Happy camper. Uh, let me go back up. If you're a patient, you caught for sure. And uh, what's up, Nicholas from Argentina? All right, next one, Sneaker Flip, Victory Flips, and Carolina Kicks. But before we get into that, $5 from the extra dollar trying to get on your level. I appreciate that. So $5 and adding on to the Super Chat. So, all right, let me, uh, let's talk about these. So Sneaker Flip with some Kyries. I don't know what size. It might be a little bit big. Uh, but still, good to see some Kyries. Victory Flips found one of the Kobe 80 Oregon's left over. No one picked them up. I don't know how long they've been sitting there. Uh, picked out one pair, probably a size 11. That's the only size we found. And picked up that one, Carolina Kicks, with the Jordan ADG Golf Shoes, size 12. And a couple of pairs in here. And I uh, haven't seen this one before. So Willie Will and uh, Stinky Feet, if you guys find these or found these, let me know in the chat. See, I found two size 18 Kyries today from Sneaky Feet. Uh, let me go back up. And let me see. Kali is dry right now. Uh, sneaky going in on people. <laughs> uh, got a Lakers jersey. Definite cop. Um, so I think that was it for Burlington. But, hey, good to see Burlington uh, coming up, trying to get back into the rankings, higher in the power rankings. So at three, it's better for them. Probably one of the best all year. Keep at it. That's good. All right. Marshall's at four stars. And now people are just killing it right now at Marshall's. Not at mine, though. Nothing but trash at my Marshall's. It's it's bad right now. But for these people that we're featuring today, great stuff. Antonio Mendez and Russo Resales and the Daily Hustle all picked up some Phantoms. And I do believe they're kids, though. But $16.99 picked up a couple of pairs. Sneaker finds 12 with the Hardens. And uh, which one would you rather ball in? So we got two options there. Next one, we have Common Fan Finds who found the Jordan 11 bread backpack for $16.99. <laughs> 17 bucks. I don't know who else has been finding it for that cheap. I think for the most part, we saw them a lot higher than that. But $17, we'll take it. We also got the Jordan 12 backpack in here. Price Assassins, don't know the price. Carolina Kicks with, what do they have on here? I guess you're sewing a different stuff. Uh, Pharrell and Air Max 2017 and the Techno Dad Shoe. Next one, and people are still killing it with the Legacy Low. Daily Finds 69 just took out like a full cart full of them. We also got Deal Finds, got 7Y, 5Y, and more. Kicks for flips, got about six, seven pairs. And RGVTX reseller got the baseball cleats full box and the legacy low as well. 7Y and 5.5Y. All right, next one. Activate hustle mode and daily find 69 again with the foam posits. $70. Ghost deals and deals. Foam posits as well. Three, four, five, six pairs and gill steals and deals. Found one without box, dead on clearance. Look at this clearance price. $39.99 down to 
thirty-six dollars. Um, how nice of Marshalls to to do that for us. <laughs> Was that down three bucks? Come on now. Um, all right, get this out of the way and uh, refresh this. I don't happen to my my video. Oh, here it is. Okay. And I think my <laughs> what the heck? I think my uh, chat froze. Okay, let me get this out of the way because I can't see anything that happened. Next thing I know, eBay Joey was in here. I didn't see anything. Um, okay, get this. Close this. And pop out chat. And it's loading. It's kind of taking a while. Jay Ochoa, my Marshalls is trash too. All right, there we go. We are we are good. All right, next one. Ten finds. Sneaker finds 12. We got the legacies, different colors on here. Uh, which one is your favorite? So we got two, three different pairs. Activate hustle mode with the air flight posit two and size six, a little bit smaller. And this one, uh, six and a half. And they are $50. Uh, let me go back up and see. Uh, Sam, what's up? And where are we? Man, I'm like way behind since this chat thing kind of froze. Uh, love the Kyries. Man, there's like so, so many messages that came in I don't even see. Um, let's see. Congrats. Oh, man, Miles. Congrats to Miles. Big ups to Miles. Um, reading his message. So uh, wife just gave birth to baby boy a couple of days ago. I'll be back on the power rankings next week. Miles, appreciate that. And you're joining us for the live show. What else can I say? Miles, you're the man. All right, next one, Bofo Merchandise, Tens Finds, and NJ Sneaker Finds. And we got the Flyknit Racer in here, Space Balls with the Dunks, and a two Air Max Plus on here, three and a half Y, a little small, $40, same thing, 40 bucks. And Thrifting Together, Activate Hustle Mode, Willy Will, and LA Thrifter Hunter found some... Uh, Project Rock at Marshall's fifty dollars. Hadn't seen this one before. Uh, Willie Will with the ninety fives. We also got the React Element fifty dollars. Surfing together. Activate Hustle Mode with the Air Force One. Let me see. Foam posit. Uh, what today at Ross? But eighty five dollars. Um, pick one up for thirty nine. Mendes finds. Which store is the best for you, Ross? Burlington or Marshall's? For sure has to be Ross. Uh, my Marshall's kind of sucks right now. Burlington's on kind of dry. Uh, but Ross out of that one, Nike outlet in general is where you get the big money um, because you can get in bulk and it's uh, pretty awesome. See you, baby. Now here's where we get into some stuff where I'm like, what's going on here? Thrifting together, Air Max 97 uh, with that camo. I saw this one at Ross, but it was kind of a small size. I think the outlets also got this one too, but size 10, $60. See in sales, look at that one. Uh, Air Max Plus 97, and then we got the Jordan uh, 31, also got uh, Air Max 2017, also got some Blazers, size 11 and 12, Activate Hustle Mode, Valley Kicks, um, so good stuff. Let's see, Salos today, Willie Will, Jose says fire. Now we get to our last slide where Flex on eBay, uh, two, look at this nice little setup too. Uh, Sneaker Finds 12 also had a great setup last week. We got complete with box 97s, which we've been seeing these at Ross in tiny, small sizes. Ooh. And then we got the Vapor Max complete with box. I remember I saw these at the outlets. We got the 90s in red, $50. And then we just got more of them. We got the camo. We got the inside out, which is also at Ross. But this one complete with box, as we know, changes everything. And another one here. So $50. Like, man, what's going on? Haven't seen any of this kind of stuff at my Marshalls. Thrifting Together also comes in with some heat. Vapor Max Plus, that uh, pink and black one. This one was also at the outlets. I don't remember which one. We saw this one. Me and Hustle B, $70. And then Complete with Box. We saw this one at TJ Maxx, 70 bucks, 10 and a half. And these are also Complete with Box. Um, so, man, let's see on here. Been seeing tiny ass sizes for 70. I know. These. Oliver Ross, like size four, size five, five and a half. Come on now. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, Lexus Hood, to get in there. All killer, no filler on these Marshalls finds. Uh, Sapathos is just everywhere. Yeah, Sapathos doesn't mess around. Um, let's see. What about Skechers Outlet Mile High Hustle? Passed on two of those green 97s today. Sneaky feet. And he has a Vapor Max just in the back. 
and too small of a sizes. And let me see. I gotta wait until next Wednesday to see today's Marshall's finds. <laughs> uh, sneaky feet and one hit a flipper. What's up? Now we get into Ross five stars. This is gonna take us quite a bit. Gene Party, we'll see ya. And here we go. Deal account 888, Parco kicks, thrifting together again, and hustle to win, all with Air Force Ones. We got the inside out. Uh, what are these called? I don't even know what these are called. Um, we got this one. It can change the swooshes out on here, $55. And then we also got these uh, like camo one in here, so $55 as well. Um, Airmax, Airmax 1. Is there more of them? Yeah, there is more of them. Jay Minaj and Hustle Crow Martino finds. These are pretty dope. $50. Uh, seeing sales as well. Kind of like a light purplish. $65. I don't know why this one's a little bit more pricey. Uh, red and black. And then uh, $55. Size 10.5 for Hustle Crow. So, man. Uh, Ross bringing the heat on Air Force Ones. Not playing around. Hustle Crow says my Ross is dry. I think employees getting good stuff. Um, will there be another World Star Hip Hop Marshalls fight video today? Unfortunately not. And I didn't double check to see if Cornelius was okay. Um, but apparently the other guy did get hurt. He had to get stitches um, on his lip. So, And he got charges, of course, for fighting. So it was a bad day for that dude. Uh, but Cornelius seemed to be okay as far as we know. Free Cornelius, Doug the Pug. $4. What's the hashtag you use? I have good finds. All you got to do is tag me on the photos in the photo. Go to my tagged photos on IG. And if you see your post there, then more than likely you will see your photo here. So you got to tag and make sure you see it on the tag photos um, on my IG. Uh, sneaky feet. <laughs> oh, man. I've been seeing a lot of weird Air Force One colorways. Hustle Crow to my Ross employees, backdoor Vapor Max and foam posits. Um, it's all CGI. I don't believe everything you see online. And we need Cornelius to out hustled Philly. Am I a special guest Cornelius for out hustled Philly? It'd be insane. I wonder what he's doing. Uh, maybe I can find that out. Now we're getting into nothing but foam posits. And we got, man, $55. And these, I believe, are women's hustle to win, kicks for flips, sneaker flip, and, uh, GTD sourcing and let me see $55. Yes, they are ladies compared at 75 and a good money on these. I think there's more too. Uh, there's one more on here from Slick Nick Sneakers and Texas Pete. Oh, this is something else. PGs, but Texas Pete with those uh, Dracula foams for kids, $40. And uh, let's see what YNGD uh, sneaks also with the foams. Uh, let me see. I've been seeing foam posits at Ross lately. How's the comps on these? I know the comps on these are really, really good. I did not check this uh, this Dracula looking one, but I don't know. Um, let's see. TWS Marketplace. Tony, what's up? It's been a while. Tony, uh, good to see you in the chat. Let's see. Love your vids. Appreciate that. Let me go back up. I've been seeing foam posits and... See, had a Ross employee tell me that one of their coworkers is a reseller. How dare they? Um, <laughs> and not only that, I believe the next week or two, they're getting their uh, once every three or four month 40% off day. So employees are going to be ready to spend and buy and get random stuff. This whole reselling thing has just become, you know, clout chasing and who finds the best stuff. Thread kicks at Air Max 95, $65, size 10. And these are pretty clean. Cop this one, smash this one. Flip the script. We love those Carhartt 95s at $65. I, I think it's a clean shoe. Silence of the Fines. We got Habanero Red. We just talked about this one. How it's been, you know, we just sold it right now on eBay. Making $10 profits. And Mr. Halfapino with these, what do you say? Hiding in the snacks, the 95s. Oh, look at that. <laughs> All right, 365 deals with the 98s. We got LA Thrifter Hunter with the 98 Hornets, which we saw these at the outlets. Now they're hitting Ross, size eight, $65. Uh, TG Sourcing with the Inside Out 98s and the Side Hustle Flip with uh, Romaleos coming with some patches and stuff in there. And also those uh, Wild West 
98. Keep at it. That's good. All right. Sold them 95s today. They're kicks. Um, <laughs> let me go back. Uh, let's see. PG's at my outlet for 35. Yeah, they're super cheap. I know the Duke kind of colorway we have. Duke, Duke E. They're like $69 extra 30 for friends and family. Even then, they didn't even sell out. I want those 90, uh, Suns and 88s you got. Mile High Hustle, we can make that happen. I still got them. Did not sell yet. Um, let's see. Ross has been having what, 50 Roma Leos. Uh, got me into Ross Fines. I ended up wearing my Fines. That, that happens a lot. Picked up two pairs. Jessica doesn't reread really the chat. Uh, let's see. Are you selling those shoes? No, I'm not selling any of these. These are people that are tagging me on Fines. And the ones I am I am selling are on G Customs 41 on eBay. How do we enter the giveaway? That will be a question coming on after this, after we go through these Ross finds. Kicks for flips, Russo resells. We talked about these small Air Max 97s, flip the script, and great steals 21. Got some foamies and uh, those Kobe ADs, which we haven't seen those in a while. $35. That's a price we know and love. Size 11 and a half. And also picked up uh, the 97s and a size six and a half. So there we go. 97s are fire. Um, plug. I remember, I think some outlets got these. I don't remember um, if they did or not. But yeah, these are clean. All right. Cam Pepper also with the 97s. And a Florida flipping two pairs of 97s down on clearance. $35. Kicks four flips. Size six and a half in blue. That one is a kid shoe. $40 and uh, 365 deals have a Nike Day 97 in blue. And I don't think I've seen that colorway before. I, I think it's a clean shoe. Let's see, price is too high on them. Um, they're too high for like baby sizes. I mean, $70 for a size five plus tax. Uh, um, all right, have a Nike Day. Have a Nike Day. Yeah, these are clean. And let's see, you wear a pair from Ross or two weeks. You can make the most profit selling them as used um, so from Zapatos. That's a nice little challenge right there. Sell them as used. See how much you can get. Um, let's see, 97 have a Nike day. So, uh, so SoCal Outlet got the 97s. Is District Deals in the house? He was earlier. I don't know if he's still here. We're not done. Arizona finds with 97s. Pretty clean colorway. And 918 reseller with the Nintendo 64 97s already making their way to Ross. These did not sell as well as Nike thought they were uh, because some Nike outlets are getting them. I've seen them clearance too at uh, on some websites, Jimmy Jazz and more. So they're now they're down to Ross. Pick them up in your size. I love them, of course. Uh, but that's pretty interesting. Glad to see those there. Also got uh, Amrax 90 and Bofo merchandise with the ones. Uh, let me see. Fire Blue have a Nike day. Uh, let's see. A back. What? A while back now. Ross is killing it, man. Found the N64 back wall flipping dollars. Nice. Texas Pete sick. Um, how much Nintendo 97s at Ross? Uh, we can't see it here. More than likely, I guess, what are the other 97s at 65? Probably. Well, this one's, I mean, this one's different. This one's at. 70. I don't know why, but who knows? I don't know how that much is, but it doesn't say. All right, let me go back. Oh, wait, where were we? Vapor Max time. Ross finds Oregon rocking the olive green Vapor Max while finding Vapor Max. And I believe Hustle B has these actually because I've seen them rock these. Uh, more Vapor Max all over the place. Vapor Max Plus, size 13, $65 for activate hustle mode and 365 deals. Cop in a couple of pair. Of Vapor Max. Uh, next one, thrifting together with easy money, seventy-five dollars. Yes, a little pricey, but two hundred plus. You should sell these, and it shouldn't take very long. Breezy finds and thrifting together again. Uh, Drum the hustler and three sixty-five deals, both with uh, more Vapor Max, sixty-five dollars. Flyknit Vapor Max, and these are the Moon Landing size seven. Heard Cornelius. Cornelia. <laughs> Oh man, uh, deal finds and Super Six Four and Jay Reynolds and uh, thrifting together all with the dunks. You guys saw these in the video. Seven and a half, thirteen. Can't see the size and can't see the size. Uh, would you rock these? That's a real question. On the bread, 
11 dunks and 35 dollars easy pickup 35 bucks just too cheap uh, but would you rock them that's all that matters have yet to find any vapor maxim geo uh, nicholas says sell texas pete for sure i haven't seen any of these shoes at ross smash i would rock and this if i says no <laughs> let's see i need the lows 10 and a half for the ones i found super six four and jose says rock them skate them for sure from kevin and too shiny all right let's go to man these are dope though these camo dunks ross shallington on his lunch break picked up a uh, nice little uh, dunk, camo dunk high. You also got bolo every day. Same price, $35, size 11. My size, just letting you know. Uh, flipping it good. Also got these dunk low true berry. That's a pretty dope colorway too. All day kicks hustler and iconic steals and deals. Uh, pick these up. Uh, that's a little bit harder to see. Can't even see what size that one is. These are like, I don't know, greasy or glowing or something. Uh, let me see. Love the dunks. Camo dunks are nice. Um, let's see. Is it spelled a different way? Nope. G Customs 41. Blue, white, black. Pretty cool. And Rock'em Syracuse dunks are fire. I love dunks from Becky to Shiny. Oh, that was the other one. Uh, Pug is barking. <laughs> Pug is barking. You heard him back there. Um, and Zapatos with the guns. All right. Sneaker flip. 365 deals with up tempos. And two different pairs. We got the Georgetown. And I don't know what this one is. But size 4. And this one looks huge. Uh, we also got the Red 90s at $40. Blended Steels. And Flippin' for Funds. Have a Nike Day. 40 bucks, size 6. Um, let me see. Dunks are good. Uh, Ross Shine to takes what his lunch break. Racks him up. Then it's back to his manager's office at Ross. <laughs> up Tempo's Fire. And uh, what's that app? And let me see. Uh, are those Cornelius collab Brown Town finds? Let me go back up and I think we're done on that one. Yeah. So pretty cool stuff on here. Next one, flipping it good with the LeBron Fruity Pebbles, size 17, $55. And then we got the Kyrie's, a little bit big, though, size 16, $55. EYBL, Ross finds Oregon. Um, got the Jordan 13 cleats and thrifting together with the glove Gary Payton's. So kind of random in there to see the uh, Super Sonics colorway. Let me see. Wouldn't wear any of those. Selling them all. Uh, the LeBron's fire from Miles. Um, unfortunately, size 17 though. But still, uh, Fruity Pebbles, you got to pick these up. Uh, your bug sounds just like mine at the same park. And I don't know what's going on. It's going wild over there. Uh, let's see. Have a Nike Days like mine. What's the app? Got Jordan in nine cleats, eight and a half. Found multiple Gary Paytons at my Ross. Uh, found the GP in Maroon, $55. Iconic steals and deals with the pennies, $55. Stone Builder with the flight posit, $75. Uh, we got the 270s A7 resells and LA Thrifter Hunter with that. Uh, that's a pretty cool kids uh, Air Max Plus. So Superman ice cream. I don't know what kind of colorway this is, but it's pretty sweet, though. I haven't seen that one. And then Texas Pete got a little stack right there on the Kids 95. Stone Builder with the cleats for the ladies, $20. That's still an easy pickup. Uh, the Man Mr. Information and with the 90s. And also got Souls and Stitches with the USA cleats. All right, next one, we got Price Assassins with the Super Bowl Eagles shirts. So Eagles fans are going to hold on to this forever. So you might as well get them now, hold on to those. And it looks like <coughs> Adidas uh, basketball jerseys coming back. These are screen printed, not sewn, $13. Retail at $70. And uh, Dana Banana with a selfie fine with a legacy. And a DMV fine, 703 Gucci sunglasses, 137 and Ross getting a little fancy. Oh, my. Let's see. Oh, man, Stevie D's gone. Say baby. Say baby. Say baby. See ya, Stevie D. You're here for a little bit. We'll see you next week. Um, all right. Next one. Uh, Denim Banana again. This time with a pretty dope-looking Vibramax Plus. $65, red, white, and blue. Two seventies, dollars $40. Chris Ramos with the Jordan Cleats. All starters got a bunch of stuff on clearance. 
And Tampa Bay finds with Harden's Ultra Boost and Kobe's. Man, so many, like, so many of these to get to. This is wild. Danny's finds. Now we're getting to cartfuls. Same ones we've seen these 97s. Uh, we got foam posits for kids. LeBron soldiers. These are pretty dope. $40. Foam posits and up tempos. Ross Shallington on his lunch break. Pretty decent grabs. And uh, today we flip with uh, some cleats, 270s, Hardens, Air Max Plus, and uh, what Air Force One for kids. Um, all right. <laughs> Let's see. So many random shoes. I know. Uh, Hardens. There's a go. There you go. Suns. Uh, 98 for a uh, mile high hustle. Tans finds also picked them up. Go with steals and deals. We got the Air Max, what Air Max one, and also the foam posits. Stealthy finds with the huge Kobe's, but even then, probably picked those up. Stone Builder also found those same Kobe's. Um, next one. Now we're just getting into <laughs> this Jay Reynolds one. I'm like, what the heck happened here? Like, got Roma Lales, Vapor Max, high end cleats. Those Gary Paytons down here, 97s, the pennies, more Kobe's, and two pairs of LeBron's. Uh, this just had a field day, and I guess no one sources this Ross at all. He just came in and just took everything. We also got 95s, 98s uh, from uh, what? Chris Sneaker Deals and the PGs, Mamba Focus, a couple of pairs of Kobe's, Kyrie's, and Soldiers. So pretty good. Keep at it. That's good. Uh, fire, damn, decent. And uh, we're at asking for a friend. Yeah, where is this guy? Thrifting Wizard, Russo Resells, Hustle Don't Stop, and Sin City Hustle, all with Kobe's, all a little bit big, and $50. This one's 40 actually, for the AD. <laughs> District Deals, a couple of different colorways of the Kobe's. Kobe AD, and this one's pretty dope right here, this Kobe AD in uh, gold and purple. This one already know, easy money. Same thing with this one, drop kicks and a sneaker find or sneaker steel finder with the uh, Hornets Kobe at 60. Have not seen this one. They were at the outlets at one point and she did the sourcing with the green and black Kobe's. Have not seen that one out there in the wild. That's a pretty dope colorway. Keep at it. That's good. Let's see, a pass, six pairs of Kobe's, all size 15 and a half. And there's so many huge Kobe's out there right now. Um, ginormous, but we want the human sizes, and we definitely want to uh, keep those. Let's see, next one. Let's see, now this, <laughs> this is what I want to find. Um, but this is size six, a little small, doesn't matter, $45, sneaker flip, Jake Gardner, um, and sneaker steel finder again, and Allen resells. 45 bucks of the pro tros and then also got the 11 so man um this is <laughs> i don't know what happened here but i'm definitely going to be looking for these i don't know what's going to happen small sizes or not does not matter got to pick those up uh pro troll laker wow fire jelly crazy finds and uh those green and black ones on ebay for big money from anna um yeah i definitely want to see those sasquatch sizes still make money that's very true also depends on the shoe, uh, but pick those up. $40 for Kobe's, easy steal, especially $40, $45, good money. I, I think it's a clean shoe. Are we done? Yeah, that's it. Power rankings this week. Not much change. I think Burlington went up a little bit. Now to three stars. DD's at one and a half. TJ Maxx two. Marshall's at four. Ross at five. So there we go. Staying high with Marshall's and Ross. Four and five stars, which means Ross still at number one, which means we're going to uh, have to give away another Ross gift card. So is this a question? Is it coming up yet? Okay, just says giveaway. I don't want to give away any spoilers yet. Giveaway time. Are you guys ready? Anybody can get this one right. Anybody. I'm not going to make you research eBay, put things in order. No, 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 no. Um, demand Mr. Information. We just saw like four of your photos on here. Um, let me, oh, so here we go. Giveaway, Ross. This is it. Are you ready to win? Very easy question. Here we go. Which NBA player wore this shoe in the 2000 Olympics? I needed to switch it up a little bit. I need the first and last name of this player. NBA player that wore this shoe. 
in the 2000 Olympics. Do you know your your players, your sneakers, history? Do you know this? Um, I need full name, first and last. Remember, what I see in the chat might be a little different than what you see. So I'm going to go with the first one that I see, and that's right. And remember, I need first and last name. Got to read the top. And the first one we get, Grant Hill, no. Vince Carter, no. Penny, no. Um, Eli Manning, no. Very close. Kobe, no. KG and Randy C., Says Gary Payton, no. KG, Gary Payton, um, Payton, Vince Carter. Omar says Kevin Garnett, which is what the answer we wanted. One first and last name. Omar, you have won $30. Two, Rouse. We got KG rocking the flat posit two for the 2000 Olympics. All right, so... Uh, <laughs> Rig dug the fug. Um, but yes, we needed the full name. We can't just say KG. We can't just say Garnett. We can't just say Kevin. We can't just say Eli Manning. We have to need, we need the full name. So congrats on that one. Why don't we mix it up a little bit? Didn't have to put things in order. Uh, I made it uh, a little easy. Let's see. I definitely been on my recount. <laughs> uh, District deals. And let me get this out of the way. And you know, I have to do this. You know that we said we we're going to do it every single time. So we have to. And we had people signing up already, sending me the email. Here's the last time I'm going to talk about it. I swear. Until next week, of course. Out Hustle 2020. I want to meet you. Please go to hustlerhacks.com slash out hustled. And here we go. Go on there. All you got to do is put uh, your first name, your last name, if you're interested in attending any of these out-hustled workshops, meetups, one-on-ones, any, any of that kind of stuff. LA, Denver, uh, Las Vegas, Dallas, Miami, Philly. Which one are you interested in? Philly's going to be huge. Stevie D's going to let us drink and hang out and eat and do whatever uh, we want to do. He's going to pay for everything. So you want to go to the Philly one if we do have that one. And we're looking to start up in June. So sign up and we can tag you and email you when we have all the details. All right, get this out of the way. And we're getting more signups because my phone is going off. And where is this? Share screen, share screen. Back to our slideshow, which we have our first entries for March Hustler Hog. Thrifting together, Jay Reynolds and Lex on eBay, AKA Flex on eBay. All three are in. And last month we had Dapper Fanatic and Russo Resells, our last two winners. So now we're going in March. We got three entered, thrifting together, Lex on eBay and Jay Reynolds 822. So Hustler Hag, you're in, and we're going to give away the Kobe's or the Kobe in the book, or maybe whatever shoes come out by then. Maybe I'll let you choose. Um, we'll figure that out at the very end. All right, let me get this out of the way and remove from stream. All right, anything else you want to say? Anything else going on? Um, smash or pass on coronavirus? Do you believe it's true? Do you believe it's hyped? I mean, people are panicking. Are you panicking? Is it stopping you from going to Ross? Are you scared that maybe someone's sick around you? Maybe you could get it. Maybe someone touched the Kobe, coughed on the Kobe, and then... Uh, you picked it up. Are you scared of that kind of stuff? Tell me in the chat. Uh, let me see. <laughs> Kevin Garnett. Uh, pass on coronavirus. Profiting off face masks. So that's what's up. Uh, wearing gloves. Lots of hand sanitizer. I'm in good health. No worries. Um, I have an immune system of a baby. So that's what's kind of tough right now. But I'm trying to stay on top of things. And we're trying to um, stay strong. Uh, let's see. If you shop at Ross, you're immune. <laughs> Peanuts World. Um, I always wear a mask at Ross from Sapatos. I got to connect and 3M face mask. Um, let's see. Whatever happened to Muggsy? It's a good question. Uh, let's see. I have an immaculate immune system. Texas Pete. Trump says it's a hoax. Um, buy stock in 3M. I never scared Felicia. Uh, that's scary. Maybe we need some breast milk. <laughs> uh, do black seed oil, bro, from Jorge and 
Heard Amazon suspended close accounts that uh, what that sold masks from Zach Hustle and Muscle. That's crazy. Coronavirus boys, <laughs> Doug the Pug, uh, buy Clorox stock now. Uh, how are Hustler Hogs picked? That's a good question. So Hustler Hogs is picked by different things. Um, I go with how many tags. I go with a variety of tags. I go with quality of finds. I go with maybe some of the random ones that are, you know, DD's discounts. I know we threw one in that no one else is tagging us on. So I try to mix it up. Doesn't necessarily have to be like you're the best sourcing person ever. Just mix it up. Um, consistently do it every week. If you're consistently doing it, um, then for sure you're going to get in somehow. I mean, I think most people have got in. Um, so that's, that's all I can tell you. Buy some Alibaba stock. Clorox is bad for you. Um, let me see. Increase your vitamin C. Uh, I need to do that. Uh, let's see. You look tired, Hustler. He looks tired. Look at him. He's got a face of a catcher's mitt. Uh, let's see. What's good? And get a pair of shoes. I did buy some stock since Corona Fears tanked the market. Uh, Clorox, too strong. I like to mix it with Red Bull. Sticky feet. Um, believe it or not, I saw that Americans, let's see, 32% of Americans do not want to drink Coronas right now. Um, <laughs> and just because of the name and it's very close to coronavirus, it's like, dude, the beer has nothing to do with the virus. Like, you can drink the beers. Like, it's okay. But apparently I saw in some article... 32% uh, 32 of Americans do not want to drink Coronas right now. Let's see. Yeah. Uh, let me see. I just had a six pack. Willie Will. Uh, this will hella baked. <laughs> look, at these, look at these eyes. They're small. How do we get to this live show? Uh, America. Let's see. While well, packing eight items. Bud Light virus. All right. Anything else? Uh, Hustlehacks.com slash out hustled. And anything else you want to say before we go? Proves 32% of Americans are idiots. <laughs> uh, that's very true. Appreciate their live show, Miles, and congrats to you again. Um, that's awesome. You can't get coronavirus without a lime. Uh, let's see. I got two cases waiting for me from Geo. And uh, did you get my message about the 3X jersey you found? Um, oh, the pants, the Lakers pants. So I picked. Actually, I didn't pick up the Lakers pants. Um, in the breakdown, I did not have the Lakers pants, but they were actually found in Phoenix. I did go to Phoenix for, I think, two, three weeks ago. I did go. And that that uh, store was Uptown Cheapskate in Phoenix, and I didn't pick them up. So, unfortunately, I don't have them, and uh, now I can't get them because, obviously, I'm many hours and miles away. Uh, but they were there. I don't know. I forgot what the price was on that one, but sorry about that one. Uh, smooth selling. Uh, let me see what else. When do you buy size 15 plus with no box? Um, depends on the model. Some of these Kobe's are like higher end Kobe's that you should take the risk on, especially like $40, things like that. So even then they're huge. Um, you can pick it up. What happened to the Celtic Jersey? That one did sell, uh, last, last year. That one did sell very, very well. Uh, what is with Goat and the Tiger Woods cleats? They won't change the skew and it keeps kicking me off. That's a good question. Sometimes Goat doesn't even answer you for a while, too. Uh, that's a good question, though. I haven't found the Tiger Woods yet, so I guess until I run into that problem, um, I will, uh, I guess I'll let you know and keep you posted. I found this. Oh, I sold size 18 Kyrie Confetti. Geo, appreciate your videos. Learned a lot from you. Um, I'm trying to get this money to help my daughters uh, pay for my daughter's college, so... Uh, thanks for that. Thanks for watching Geo and taking action, actually going to stores and, uh, finding stuff. Um, thoughts on Sakai, Burlington, DMU, fake from Vince. I need to get into that. Sorry about that. I kind of left my DMs hanging a little bit. I answered them all and then they regenerated because they answered quick and then I need to get back into it. Um, did you sell the ASAP Rocky shoes? I did sell those. I think on go, I think I sold them for... 350 something like that i think it was 350 is what i sold them for um i think what was someone on here on grail they sold them for like 450 or something that's insane 
Uh, did you get my, what, did you get any size Kobe 14? Let me know. Um, I do have a couple of pairs. So I'll let you know on that one. Uh, do you have any bread four left? No, but I do have bread 11s um, quite a bit. Uh, have a good weekend. Big game. Lakers on Friday versus Bucks. Sunday versus Clips from David. Um, yeah, Lakers. And then they beat, um, who did they win? I know they won yesterday. Uh, LeBron out here shooting from half court. Uh, <laughs> So I saw that one. And also saw Shaq with the hairline, which is pretty hilarious. All right, we are done. And I'll see you guys next week. Keep tagging me on the finds. We'll have three brand new March Hustler Hog candidates. They'll be thrown out there. Be safe out there. Hit the like button. Appreciate that. Hit that like button. And I'll see you guys next week. Go out and get it.